Welcome back to Halo 3 The Covenant. It's not my fault that The Covenant is the best mission in Halo. Also, it's the only mission people tend to make mods for. This is another mod that replaces a bunch of Halo stuff with other stuff. We'll take a look at this one. This one looked pretty good from the Steam thumbnails. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, that wasn't in the Steam thumbnail. All right, we got Amogus Grunt. This is already the greatest mod. This is already the best Halo mod. It literally can't get better. I don't know why the pelicans are pterodactyls. I don't know why they're a dinosaur. RIP pelican. Ornithopters. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's Duncan inspired. All right, let's kill some Amogus. Die, Amogus. <laughs> it's the AUG. Nice. Dude, the AUG looks good on Halo guy. The AUG is like the same shade as his armor. What the heck? The AUG almost blends right in. I thought they were geese. I don't think they're geese. They had a large snout. We'll probably see them again. I see you hiding down there, Mogus. When the grunt is sus, I will use this blazer effectively. Which I did not do last time I played this level. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> it works. Get them both. Can I get them both? Come on. Yeah. If I can save that for the Brute Chieftain, that's going to do numbers versus the Brute Chieftain. There's Buzz Lightyear. Why is Buzz Lightyear here? Me shooting Buzz Lightyear in the head. That's what Pixar did with their new Buzz Lightyear movie. Did anybody watch that movie? Did that movie make like $1? It looks so lame. From the trailers, that movie just looks lame. At least the trailer for Inside Out 2 doesn't look lame. The Buzz Lightyear just look lame. Where's Buzz Lightyear? There he is. Buzz Lightyear. What the heck? He's like cell shaded. He's like cell shaded in Halo. What the heck? That's weird. It had a good twist. What, that Zerg was his father? That was already in Toy Story, bro. Star Wars stole it from Woody. Alright, the grunt looks normal. Not the grunt. The brute looks normal. Close. Was Buzz Lightyear Zerg's father? Was that the real twist? Master Chief, you mind telling me what you're doing in medbay? Sir, finishing my tasks. Oh my god. My AUG is almost out of ammo. Then this pelican got some bullet in it. This pelican sucks. Where's the bullet? Gotta go fuel Robin over here. There we go. It's an old trick. You duplicate the geometry, scale it, and flip the normals so it renders inside out. Interesting. I under I actually understood some of that, not all of it, but some of it I did get. I will beat the prophet shield like a drum. You're talking to a guy who has Seagird in Blender at my beck and call. That's Star Wars. I saw Star Wars. <laughs> Halo 3 rat mongoose. Give me that. That's mine. Wait, no, I don't I wanna I wanna drive it. Get off. Give me that. What is the twist of uh, the Buzz Lightyear movie? What the? Oh no! Halo 3 Rat, stay with me! We got a Mogus on Ghost. I repeat, we got a Mogus on Ghost. If I made this mod, the Ghost would be replaced with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 2009 Ghost. Wearing his signature gray hoodie. It's got a kazoo in there. Nice. We don't need Marty O'Donnell. We have kazoos. This game must take place in your apartment. Yeah, there's so many rats around here. K 
Halo 3, the rat apartment. Get over here, Mogus. You will fall. Last time I played this, I died on this part like 25 times. Let's aim for an even 20 this time. Zerg is another buzz from an alternate timeline? That's awful. That sucks. <laughs> I am you. In a different world, we were. I was evil, Buzz. That's so trash, dude. How is he Buzz from another timeline if he's also Buzz's father? What is that? Was uh, was the robot or the blue lady in that one? Because he used to have an old Buzz Lightyear cartoon where he had a robot and a blue lady. Were they in that? They have a cameo. The exterminator's gonna install a halo rig in your apartment, yeah. That's what I need. Uh, which unit is yours? Uh, installation 04. Up on the second floor. What is that? Oh, there we go. I can carbine and this blazer. I can have my cake and eat it too. Oh, yeah. Is there ever a cake song where they use the lyric, have my cake and eat it too? Or that'd be too meta for them? I'm going to have my cake and I'll eat it too. All right. All right, here we go. It's going to be epic. Watch this big blast. Die <laughs> for Halo. This one's for Cortana. You son of a buzz. Too easy. It did say on the mod page to play on normal, so it's not my fault that it's easy. Good work, Chief. That's one. The Arbiter should be just about to... That's two. It's all up to Johnson's team now. You can do a Johnson's team. I might have skipped a cutscene there. Whoops, that's Star Fader's lightsaber. All right, that's mine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why is the reticule just a rectangle? The reticule is just... Dun, 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 dun. Have cake and eat it too actually means you cannot read the benefits of something without earning it. The correct saying should be to eat cake and have it too. Is that true? I don't feel like analyzing your paragraph. I'll just agree with you. Yeah, you're right. You know what? You're right. You're right about that one. That's for sure. One of the members of Cake always tells the truth, and one always tells lies, and one always does a trumpet solo. Which one will you ask for directions? Uh, does this door lead to the kingdom's realm? Alright, thanks. Oh, it doesn't make a swooshing sound. He tried to frag me. You're trying to frag Master Man. Master Chief! Oh my god, that works so well. Master Chief! There are too many of them. What are we going to do? Save your hey, hey, I'm on your How much health do you have? Hey, hey, Is friendly fire off or something? Look at me. I'm a killing machine. I forgot that Star Wars Revenge of the Sith was a Bethesda game where children are invulnerable. ODST is just built different, true. Let's go for a ride. No offense, Master Chief, but I'm built different. Alright, I saw a Republic gunship. I want to pilot that Republic gunship. That is something I will be needing to get my hands on. Dude, the draw distance for Halo 3 is really low. You don't notice it until you play on, like... Not an Xbox 360, but it's really low. And yet it still looks gorgeous. This still looks better than games today. Whenever you go on a like a video of an old game or an old movie, people will be like, this looks better than games or movies today. Still holds up. It's like, come on, man. I know you like I know you like it, but it does not hold up. Big smoke! Why is he Jedi? I want Jedi. Yeah, like my father before me, baby. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! It's playing Fortunate Son. That's gonna get copy strike. Maybe it won't. Hopefully it doesn't get copy strike, because that's awesome. Okay, it was like three seconds of Fortunate Son, which should be fine. 
Let's go. Oh, it's playing it again. Uh, I'll try to leave it in for YouTube. It might not be able to. If I can't leave it in for YouTube, I'll put 8-Bit Fortunate Son Remix, so you still get the effect. And yes, the Republic Gunship is making the Republic Gunship sound effects. And also, it really wants to turn in a circle for some reason. I don't know why. Am I flying it, or is the odd stuff flying it? I think the odd stuff is flying it, which is the issue. Come back down. Yeah, I have the rear gun. Oh my god. Some folks are born, made to capture the flag. All right, get back on the ground, Atsa. Master Chief got killed by the blue lightsaber. All right, the pilot seat is the frontmost seat. Yeah, pilot the lat, there we go. Here we go. Is it a Battlefront 2 reticule? Oh, you shouldn't have. Let's go capture our command post. Finally, a mod that makes the Pelican Gunner actually good. Pilot, aim for the weak pot spot on that ship. And then the pilot shoots the weak spot, which he was going to do already. And Obi-Wan goes, good call, my Padawan. Hey, you should try attacking it at its weakest spot, professional pilot. Yes, sir, I will do that. I was already going to, but I, I will do it now. You're a genius, Anakin. How did you think of such a maneuver? Okay, the, the Covenant song is still playing. Even though Fortunate Son is also playing. Two of the best songs ever back to back? I don't mind. Around the survivors, a perimeter create. I love how all the clones in Attack of the Clones are just like awkwardly carrying their rifle at their hip. Like, why aren't they aiming? I guess that's also true about the Stormtroopers, though. I guess the Stormtroopers in old Star Wars. Old Star Wars? Oh, God. In real Star Wars, the Stormtroopers also like awkwardly shoot from the hip because the armor really restricts their movement. So I guess the clones do that because the Stormtroopers did it, but... I mean, would anyone really be complaining if the clone troopers held the rifle normally? Their HUD helps their gun aim? I mean, that's that's pretty copium. Because the clones are just like some nerd doing mocap. Like the guy that ran the mocap stage was just pretending to be the clone troopers. And I'm dying on the Covenant again. I totally didn't die on purpose to play as a Republic gunship more. I would never do that. They were CGI? Yeah, I know. They, they were CGI, but they didn't want the armor to clip into itself, which it still does. The armor in Attack of the Clones still does clip into itself many times. But in order to avoid clipping, they had to give him the severely restricted range of motion. That's why in Clone Wars, all the clones are like real skinny, so their arms can flap about more. Yeah, maybe their HUD aims for him. That's fine. A lot of sci-fi guys have a HUD that aims for them, but if, if the clone troopers have a HUD that aims for them, that really makes the stormtroopers look real bad. Maybe that technology was too expensive to give to stormtroopers and the Empire gave up. Maybe only Kaminoans had that. Forward, my allied B pterodactyls. Let's blast them. I right, blow him up. I kind of wish I could be a ball gunner. Being a ball gunner on a Republic gunship looks so fun. It's not that fun, though, in Battlefront. Like, that gun sucks. That gun has, like, no range of motion. You can only hit some stuff on the left or right and not very good. Because it's a straight line laser, so it's really hard to aim since you're moving. There's probably a reason that, like, gunner seats on big old ships usually use projectiles or like laser projectiles instead of a straight line because a straight line has to stay centered on the target no matter what to hit you can't just like be on it for one second then click and then you're good 
Alright, we should be mostly clear. We gotta kill that droid carrier down there. Die, battle droid. Oh, hello, friendly ship just fading into existence. That's exactly the kind of draw distance crap I'm talking about. Oh, dude, I wanna, I wanna take down a Scarab with a Republic gunship so bad. Is this the? Yeah, this is the Falcon replacer, right? This isn't a Pelican replacer. The Pelican is that. So yes, I will be able to fight the Scarab with a Republic gunship, which has been my dream. There's that Halo 3, uh, like, Battlefront mod. That mod's pretty good, too. I wish the Halo 3 Battlefront mod the best of luck in developing their mod, because Battlefront 2 is really good. It's so good they're going to sell it again for, like, 30 bucks, which lol. But you got to admit that the Halo 3 gunplay is, like, a million times better. Hello, T-Poseman. The Halo 3 gunplay is, like, a million times better than Battlefront. So if eventually, after, like, five years... We can have Battlefront 2 maps with Halo gameplay. Oh my god. Like the whole game. Like, ima oh, imagine like Galactic Conquest, but it's Halo gameplay. That'd be so good. That would be the best game ever. I think the pterodactyls are from Avatar, maybe. The Avatar army guy's equipment does look suspiciously similar to Halo guy's equipment. Which looks suspiciously similar to alien guys' equipment. Which looks suspiciously similar to... Blah, 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 blah. It's not their fault there's only like three kinds of armor that looks cool. If you're making a sci-fi franchise and your armor looks lame, just, just steal good armor from someone. Just get someone else's armor and take it. Don't have bad armor. Just plagiarize the armor. No one will care. I liked the two, uh, the two Dune movies. They were good, but uh, mm, all the guys except for the Sardaukar look really lame, dude. Like the House Atreides soldiers, they suck. What the? Oh no, it's Minecraft guy. I hate that guy. A lot of hit points on that guy. I have no idea what he's called, but I have seen him before. We live in a post-Dolman world. Yeah, just base it off Dolman. Although the uh, the Dune guys do look very Dolman-esque. Although I did like uh, in Dune 2, I liked how the Harkonnen soldiers look like that one Fallout Securitron. I liked how the Harkonnen soldiers just looked so stupid. They looked so dumb. It was a good way to visually show that they're way out of their depth trying to fight the Fremens. Then the Sardaukar show up and do nothing. The Sardaukar show up and take their helmet off like Master Chief and walk into a doorway and die. Good job, Sardaukars. Spoilers for Dune. Dune wins. Dune is victorious at the end of the movie. I watched Pacific Rim and the suits are very Mass Effect in Pacific Rim? Uh... Yeah, I guess more Mass Effect 2 and 3 E. I, I, when I think Mass Effect, my go-to is Mass Effect 1, even though that's not, like, the vast majority of Mass Effect is not Mass Effect 1. Look at the Arbiter. Oh, God, you're right. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Why? I can only imagine the horrors that NSFW mod does as a thick Arbiter. That's bad. But yeah, Mass Effect 1 is very, like, everything is round. Mass Effect 1 is everything is curves, and then occasionally you have a straight line going through the curve, like, at a vertical angle, and you're like, whoa, dude. That's so futuristic. Because it's, like, sleek. It's all sleek and crap, but then there's, like, a line, like, circuitry. 
But then Mass Effect 2 and 3, yeah, the armor is just like, like especially like a Mass Effect 3 Vermeer survivor armor. That's very Pacific Rim. Where'd you find this? It's on Steam Workshop. I'm surprised Steam Workshop allows an NSFW patch to be on the workshop. Usually got to go to Nexus mods for those. Not that I would know. <laughs> now they're invisible. I must use the force. Master Chief, you switched off your targeting visor. What's wrong? Nothing. I'm all right. You mean Lover's Lab, though? We don't talk about Lover's Lab. Unfortunately, Lover's Lab does have some good mods on there, though. Sometimes you need a mod from Lover's Lab for one of the features. Not for the other features, I swear. I swear I just need the one thing. Like I've said before, the Lover's Lab people are very good at getting custom animations to play. So if you're making a musical about Skyrim, very helpful mods. However, you need to be careful not to hit the wrong key. Or things become very bad very fast. Get out of here. I got double shotguns. Hit the switch, Chief. I have more than one shotgun. All right, cutscene me. Let's see it. What will the scarab be? Will the scarab have a replacer? Now, prophet. Your end has come. Oh, it's Thomas. Oh, my God. By the gods, yeah, I get him, back. Skyrim. Pick him up with your wheels. Is that a crab wearing a top hat and a monocle? The flute is here. There's a flute. Oh no, the flute. Merry Christmas. I'm assuming somebody knows what this is. Something Christmas related. This is the worst Christmas carol since the Jim Carrey one. I think that one sucks, to be honest. They got that Uncanny Valley animation. Talk about a film that hasn't held up well. Polar Express, Jim Carrey Scrooge. Yeah, Muppets is the best. If you're going to watch a Scrooge, you might as well just watch the Muppet one. Because Ebenezer is still trying in that one. Like, he's still actually doing dramatic acting. But also the Muppets are there to make it fun. I think the best Christmas Carol adaptation, though, might be uh, Can You Beat Skyrim as Seagird on Oboshu's Games. That was a pretty good one. I did enjoy that one. I wonder if the T-posing elites are on purpose, or are they just like a result of whoever made this messing with the files, and that happened and they just kept it in. They're like, yeah, it's funny. We'll just keep that. A good old Mike Cocaine, a true professional actor. Quickly, I must see the point of impact. Hello, 343. They should replace 343 Guilty Spark with like a 343 Industries logo. So I can shoot it with a Goss Hog. Am I right? Maybe a controversial opinion, but 343 Industries is not good. This is go. What is this? This looks like the battle station from Battalion Wars 1. Anybody remember that game? That's a great game. It's from Halo Wars? Okay. That makes sense. Is it going to fire two shots? Oh, it does. Nice. Bungie does some hot garbage these days, too. I have never gotten into Destiny, so I can't comment on Destiny's quality. Marathon looks cool. 
It's going to be an extraction shooter, so I won't play it, but it looks cool. You got to say, Marathon does look really cool. I don't know if the game will be good, but they got good vibes on that one. Bum, bum. Oh no, the Amogus died. Poor Amogus. I can't believe the Amogus is flailing in the air. Die, brute. Why they gotta ruin it by making an extraction shooter? Maybe it'll be good. Maybe it'll be a good extraction shooter. Might be good, you don't know. We might be all eating our words when it comes out for PS6. Here we go, Bungie is back. None of the old game studios are coming back. It's not gonna happen. Can't wait for Arcane to make a third person blade game with Fortnite graphics. Oh yeah, all right. Oh yeah, that's what I want. Is that a cliff? Okay, it's not, but I drove a cliff. I thought I met my demise. Wait a minute, it was the Pelican. Crap, the gunship was the Pelican. Because there's the other guy. There's a little guy. You're not what I was uh, hoping for. Can I please have a Republican gunship? Pretty please. Oh, there's one. How do I get that? Is he going to land? Oh, he's landing it over there. Oh, no, he's not. He's just flying it around aimlessly. Maybe he's trying to land? The AI is very confused. The AI does not know how to pilot the Republic gunship. I count two Repeat, two they weren't scarabs. raised in Kamino to perform that task. All right, let's get him clones. Let's get him Captain Rex. This mod needs Dune Ornithopter, that'd be good. They got that Dune MMO they're making, and they're making like a, is Dune Survival Crafting and Dune MMO the same game? I think they are. I think I think the Dune MMO is more like a Conan Exiles than like a WoW, which is good. I might actually play a Conan Exiles. I'm sure there's 5,000 Dune app games that are terrible. I found out there's an actual, fully licensed, like actual real Walmart game. Like it's made by Walmart in which you run a Walmart, but it's for iPads. So I gotta, I gotta buy an iPad to play the official Walmart game. I had no idea there was an official Walmart game where you manage a Walmart. And it's like, do you have what it takes to be one of our elite employees? Find out by playing the Walmart iPad game. That'll be a good one. Here's a Dune Modern Warfare event. Yeah, they got Timothy Chalamet in there. Concentrate your fire on number two. Be gone, Skayrab. It's a secret recruitment tool for Walmart? I doubt it. I don't think many people are going out of their way to download the Walmart game. Besides me. Unless they do it as a joke for their hilarious content. Marines, kill the stragglers. Die, straggler. Who's straggling? Stop straggling. All right, thick arbiter, it's you and me. What ungodly thing will they do to Miranda in this cutscene? I want to play as Benny Jesser. Well, you got to watch that. Uh, HBO's making Benny Jesser at the TV show. They're making like Benny Jesser at Chronicles, a Dune story. Wonder if that'll be good. Are they actually? Yeah, it's called like Benny Jesser at Rogue One. I don't know what it's called. I hope every episode is like, they just go around the entire universe going, put your hand in the box, put your hand in the box, put your hand in the box. It asked, and I answered. 
Cortana, get out of here. No one cares. My faithful, stand firm. Though our enemies crowd around us, we tread the blessed path. In a moment, I will fly Come on, Thick Arbiter, we gotta move. And all who believe shall be saved. What if the prophet is thick? Chief, how close are you? Not close Not enough. Close enough. Is he wearing a Burger King crown? Was he? That the best you got. <laughs> Nicest cigars, Johnson. Yeah, I think it is. I think it is a Burger King crown. You imbecile. Have it your way. This is the best Burger King game since Sneak King. See Miranda. A lot of fade the blacks in this cutscene. I remember a lot of fade the black action. Johnson, sound off. <laughs> Come on. Out of here. Not without you. That's mean. She just wants to go to war. What's wrong with going to war? Will light the rings. You cannot hope to kill them all. It looks like he's eating an entire pack of hot dogs. Yeah, it kind of does. Now, Sergeant Glizzy. No! No, Miranda. Your forefathers wisely set aside. The Number fifteen, Burger King Brute Spiker. The last thing you want in your Burger King burger is a covenant weapon. But unfortunately, that might be what you get. Alright, we saw all the twists the cutscene's gonna have. Let's go, let's go, weird flood Santaman. Is the crown on that as well? It's not. So the hologram is like its own model, not based off the other model is with a blue filter. Interesting. Interesting Halo lore. Big Smoke is bad? I have been betrayed by Big Smoke. I could never have guessed. It makes sense, though, that he would work for the Burger King. He wants two number nines. Forward, Thick Arbiter. Into the battle we must plunge. R.I.P. Oh uh, yeah, probably the hammer is not as good. How many fuel rods do I have left? Yeah, I'll try the fuel ride for the hammer, because hammer is good on fluid. Which is coming up shortly. Woody! What are you doing here? You've got a parasite in me. You've got a parasite in me. It's the flood and it's controlling my brain. You got a parasite in me. Forward, Woody. We gotta do this for Andy. You think Andy plays Among Us on his phone? Think he likes Among Us? Oh, I didn't. I didn't notice the front of Arbiter. I only noticed the back of Arbiter, but the front of Arbiter has also been augmented. Oh God, why? <laughs> why would you do that, the Arbiter? Poor Arbiter. Okay. Can you see, Arbiter? The moment of salvation is at hand. 
will not last. Your kind never believe in the promise of the sacred ring. Lies for the weak, beacons for the deluded. I will have my revenge on a prophet, not a plague. My feet. I wish he had the lightsaber. I shall become a god. You will be fooled. Nothing more. No! Wow, so this one button? This one control panel shuts down the entire Galaxy Blaster 9000? Toy Story 5 will be Andy in his 30s looking for nostalgia on eBay. Yeah, haha, stupid Andy. Stupid Andy buying bio I, I mean Woody's, not Bionicles. Who would ever go on eBay and buy a Bionicle used part lot? Bulk piece is good mix. Some masks included. Who would buy multiple of those? Not me. You are not looking at a guy that would do that. Oh no, another song. Here we go. We gotta get out of here, Arbiter. The Flood has a theme song. Not me trying to buy every Rakshi set. Nope, not me. Well, Rakshi is easy to get. Bionicle Star is Rakshi does not count. You know what I've been liking these days is uh, so-called shiny Bionicles, where you take a like a Bionicle and you swap the colors around, like shiny Visorax. Someone on Bionicle subreddit has been making like shiny Rahis. I'm like, oh, I want all those. I want every possible color combination of every bow rock. Not when you're in Australia, oh yeah. The Australian shipping fees, that's true. It's pretty brutal to send or receive a package to or from the land down under. I'm kind of sad the music stopped. I wanted to fight while the music plays. Are there counterfeit Bionicles there? Yeah, there's plenty of fake Bionicles. Is Arbiter bad now? Why is he red? Why are you red, Arbiter? Why'd you betray me, Arbiter? What did I do? Why is he pissed? Go fight the Flood. We trade one foe for another arbiter. That's your famous line. Why does he hate me? Arbiter, please. We have to work together as friends and allies. I used to know the optimal way to like sprint through this. I got that achievement for speed running Halo 3. Beat the campaign in like under three hours, I think. I used to know all the tricks, but they have vacated my memory. The only Halo 3 knowledge I have now is Thick Arbiter. I'm a thief, but I keep what I steal. No one knows what that means, Cortana. What are you talking about? I wish I had Google Bard in my helmet instead. Crap, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. This doesn't exactly have the oomph that the real grab hammer has. I may have to incendiary my way to victory here. There it is, Master Man. The light at the end of the Halo Tunnel. 
Bum, 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 bum. That was that Halo 3 mod. An interesting mod, to say the least. I like the Republic gunship the best. That was my favorite part. <laughs>